what are http get and http post get and post are two important http verbs http hypertext transfer protocol manages the request response between client and server now after this answer another counter question can be asked and that is one of the most asked questions in any asp.net or web api interviews the question is what are the differences between get and post so to answer this question just remember the following few points remember get parameters included in url whereas post parameter included in the body get request shouldn't make any changes to the server whereas post is to make changes to the server in a get request we can send uh, data in plain text whereas in a post request we can send binary as well as text data get request is idempotent whereas post request is non idempotent what does that mean idempotent we will say a request is idempotent if aside from error or expiration issues the side effect of an identical request is the same as for a single request let me give you an example to uh, explain um, this um, in a bit more um, easy way so if i give you example of asking for a bank balance asking for a bank balance will give the same value each time you do it with the no side effect until another operation changes the bank balance on the other hand an operation to add 20 pound to a bank balance is not a important request since each call would increase the value i hope you got the answer of this question